Any exercise in general would be beneficial to patients with COPD. Perhaps the easiest way to think about this is that the lungs are responsible for bringing oxygen into the body and delivering it to the muscles of the body. If you are not exercising, your muscles will become weak, and also if you are overweight, this will be an increased workload on your muscles and demand more oxygen from them. So if patients can exercise and strengthen their muscles and reduce the amount of weight they're carrying, this will make it easier on the lungs <clears throat> to deliver the oxygen. The types of exercise that are helpful in COPD are anything that will get your cardiopulmonary system working. For patients who have never exercised before, I highly recommend walking. It's the simplest thing to do and it's safe. If you do have an experience with exercise and are used to biking or swimming, these two are excellent exercises for COPD. Pulmonary rehabilitation has been shown in multiple studies to be very beneficial for patients with COPD. Pulmonary rehabilitation is essentially an exercise program that's performed under the supervision of a trained physical therapist. What's important for COPD patients when they do their physical therapy is that they have some of their vital signs, including their oxygen levels, measured during exercise. Some patients may need supplemental oxygen during their exercise and may need the help of the physical therapist to determine how far they can push themselves. The benefit of pulmonary rehabilitation is that patients generally can improve their exercise tolerance. They will be able to walk farther, feel less shortness of breath during exercise, and overall feel better after doing series of planned exercises.